It is Ryan's birthday. I'm all actually both be 21, so it's gonna be even more fun. My presets launched because I've been working like my ass off on that, and I feel like super bougie. Hey guys, welcome to this vlog. I actually deleted like the intro clip to this vlog, so currently on this vlog date, it is Ryan's birthday. It is June 20th, and I got him two other presents that I deleted the clip for. I'm so stupid. I was just trying to make space on my memory card, and you know, that got deleted. So, I wanted to show you guys what I got him, um, and then it will go into the vlog again. <laughs> I'll tell you the backstory of my wallet problem. Mm -hmm. I had this really long wallet that flipped open, and it was skinnier, but stuck out of my pocket a little bit, easy to pick pocket. <laughs> then I had a black one, it wasn't that nice, mm -hmm. so when the sun was in Italy, mm -hmm. she got me the nicest wallet ever. Let's see, let's see. Look at this, it's already patinaed up here. Can you see that? No. Can you see that there? That's like darker. And apparently that's good, right? Yeah, well the nice, like the longer you have it, the nicer leather it'll get. Mm -hmm. but let's see it. I'm supposed to treat it, but I'm not going to because I kind of like the way it looks rugged. Mm -hmm. But, it says, can't see credit card information please. It says made in Italy, and it's like this cute like gray ashy it's almost like suede. brown yeah it's really nice it's super soft and then i got you a belt yeah and i have a really nice belt i needed it last night i didn't bring it now we can continue with the vlog beautiful isn't it it is uh, one of those earphones mm -hmm. uh grande cold foam cascara cold brew and i get free stuff on my birthday in my app yay that's good <laughs> Mind, I don't know, let's just text you. What is all that? That's, That's Kara Cold Foam Cold Brew. But is it just like the like is it is that cream sitting on the top? What is yeah, that? It's been cream tasted. What the heck? I didn't even get the coffee. I don't know. Just to mix it up and oh. add flavor, but I call it drinking the foam and cold brew. I'm kind of getting used to the taste of coffee now but I still don't really like want to love it, you know? I don't know. Comment down below if you are like me that like, you just like don't want to like it. Ryan looks so professional with his AirPods in, making business phone calls and such. I gotta call a client. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we are headed to the salt factory in downtown Roswell for my birthday lunch. And Ryan's gonna order a beer for the first time ever. Legally. No, for the first time ever. Yeah. We're gonna go eat. I'm not feeling too hot. I feel like that matcha tea kind of messed me up. I am lactose intolerant, so I kind of knew what I was getting myself into, but it doesn't really like make me feel like this shitty usually. But oh well, still wanna eat. Always wanna eat, actually. Fun fact, that's where I used to work, the pie hole. I miss it. We're actually coming back here to Canton Street slash Historic Roswell, it's the same thing, um, tomorrow <clears throat> because tomorrow is a lot after five. If you guys aren't from Roswell, then you probably don't know what that is. Basically, it's just like a community event, would you say? It's like, yeah, shut down the uh, main street and... Yeah, like, they shut down the whole main street and you can, like, pretty much drink, like, open containers and, like... It's like a music festival, it's not much music. Yeah. Well, actually, there is kind of music. Yeah, like, you say not much. It's not good. It's a set band playlist kind of thing. So. Yeah. And there's just like restaurants all over here and shops and stuff like that. So it's like, very fun. It's literally a big high school reunion because all of our high school peeps always come. And it's just really, really fun to see everyone again. So I'm excited. Especially because Ryan's actually going to come with me this time. This time we'll actually both be 21, so it's going to be even more fun. So this is Canton Street, and this is pretty much the street that they shut down. Right over there is my favorite, Zest Sushi. We are 
now at the Avalon and we're gonna go get Ryan's new glasses. Uh, what's it called? Like the sides are too short. They like heave them up and like make them longer. Oh shit. Makes better. Hey guys, happy Saturday. It is June 23rd and we are on our way to Buckhead. And I feel like every vlog I show like a little clip of Buckhead because that's just like somewhere fun that we love to go. But this time it's special because we are going to the Whitley and it used to be the Ritz Carlton. And we got a hotel room for Ryan's birthday and all his friends are gonna come tonight. We're just gonna go out in Buckhead. I'm really excited because we are prepared to swim in their indoor pool and apparently it's supposed to be really cool. So, um. Yeah, it is raining, but thank God it's like an indoor pool. Hopefully it's heated, that'd be nice. Um, so I have like my swimsuit on <laughs> under this. But our check-in time's only at three and it's like 1.30 right now, so hopefully we can like, you know, ask to like just like hold our bags or something. And guess where we are going tonight? Brother freaking Umi. Umi! Umi's our favorite, favorite, favorite sushi restaurant ever. It's funny how far we've come. I feel like we used to go to like Cheesecake Factory for every birthday and like holiday, but now we've, we've upgraded to now. Umi. Past like four years, we've been to Umi for everything. Yeah, I know, but like when we Second. started dating, we would go to like Cheesecake well, Factory or like sushi. Ever made me like sushi, and I always want it. Yeah. It's a very expensive addiction, I will say that. A live after five was really fun. I didn't vlog just because, you know. She's slacking, she's like. I am slacking, I'm truly slacking. I don't know what's wrong with me. I think Italy vlogs burnt me out a little. Like not saying that I didn't enjoy that because like I loved vlogging and like I was super comfortable with it. But like now, I don't know, I'm back in the States and I'm like, ugh, it's just my everyday life and it's not like super fun and I don't know. Just not Something feeling it. Really I know and I want to like show you guys my everyday life and I want to insta story more but I just for some reason I'm in a funk and I hate being in a funk especially over summer when I have like all the time in the world to like not be in a funk but hopefully I can start doing all this after my presets launch because I've been working like my ass off on that I've done like my whole site myself which is a super big thing for me like I am tech savvy I will say but like to do like a WordPress site. I don't know if you guys have, you know, ever like played around with it, but like that shit's hard. So just kind of taking it day by day, but there's always something that's going wrong. Like right now, my payment thing's like not working. So I have to like call someone and I don't know. It just, it's getting a little frustrating, but hopefully I can like put them out like super, super soon. So I'm really excited. Definitely go check them out. The link will be in the description box and yeah. We made it to our hotel room. Lenox Mall, Skyline. I don't know. We're going to the pool on the roof. There's some. Buy tickets from the seniors in high school. And they... If you went to Roswell High School, <laughs> you know. What is it? If you know, you know. Yeah. Just Obviously, it's a hair washing day for me. I prepared. <laughs> fitness center and then there's the pool. Woohoo, how fancy. Honey crisp apples in it. There is, look. Don't lie to me. Those are honey crisp. Those are not honey crisp. I know my honey crisps. Dun dun dun. So I just showered. I put on the Whitley robe. I got like my little head towel on and I feel like super bougie. And I think I'm about to do an Instagram live. I haven't done one of these in so long. And like it kind of scares me because like, I don't know, like I always get like eight people on it, which is like a lot for me, I guess. But then they start to leave and it's like two people and I'm like, okay, well, bye. And I get it. It's not really all about the numbers, but also like I just like end it when that happens. But I think I'm going to try it again.
strawberry, huh? Oops. Oh, <laughs> During my live, um, the person knocked on the door. And they brought us cake. Well, actually, not really us, but Ryan, because it's his birthday. I want that. Can I have it? Mm. Thank you. <laughs> Is it yummy? We need to try the cake. I want to try the cake. I was not expecting a Cadillac to be taking us to Umi. Oh, yeah, it was like the free yeah. like transfer from the hotel. Like Ford Focus or something. <laughs> <laughs> um, but we just made it to the Umi Square, right there. But I want to do an OTD. This is a Peter Millar like Puma Cotton shirt. Very cute. With the Nautica shorts with a stretchy waistband from Umi. <laughs> Cole Hans, Frank Mueller, and that's it. Simple summer outfit. <laughs> All right, so this romper jumpsuit kind of thing is from Bershka, and I got it in Italy, and it was like really affordable store in Italy. I can tell. But it was a crack in my pants, like a literal. You sewed it up. Yeah. Oh wait, there it is. What? Is it bad? No, it's fine. But yeah, Ryan was like, uh, "You got like a rip in your pants." I was like, "Are you serious? It's like new." So I literally had to quickly sew it. Thank God for like little hotel kits. <laughs> These shoes are from Target, I think, and they're just really comfortable, small heels. Guess how lucky we just got? We were sitting next to this couple, and I, I heard them say they were gonna go to Himitsu, and they were like, oh, like, right. Yeah, like just walk us down there or whatever. And then the guy was like, oh, we're not gonna go because I don't feel good anymore. And then like we were kind of like talking to the couple like, you know, throughout you our meal. You never heard of my birthday, you tried to buy me shots. Yeah. I was like, no, it's okay, I promise. <laughs> like, you know, I don't want you guys to do that. And um, anyway, so then he was like, oh, it's okay. Like, um, we're not gonna go to me too anymore. And then the girl was like, oh my God, no, like we'll give them our spot so we're literally just taking their Hamitu spot and if you didn't know that's where my dad took me on my 21st birthday it's literally like <laughs> I know, are we are doing the same things but um yeah so it's like a kind of um what's exclusive. it called like yeah exclusive bar it's like a speakeasy almost yeah with like type this code in yeah so they sent me a code and you have to type it in and it's a really cool atmosphere and stuff like that so we will see what drink he gets <laughs> How are you? Out, I had shorts on. <laughs> oh. Wow. What about going to the St. Regis? Oh, it looks pretty. really pretty. They yeah. don't? Yeah, shorts. I mean, we could try. Yeah. Well, now we know. Don't ever come to Umi in shorts because you never know where you'll be after. Oh. So, since we got kicked out of Me Too, and <laughs> I'm kidding, we had a little time to spare. We decided to come to Lenox Mall because I didn't really like the outfits that I brought. So of course, I went to Forever 21 and they had such cute outfits. I got two dresses so I can pick from them when I get back. So I put on the dress that I got from Lenox Mall and it's actually like overall. I'll show you guys. So it looks like this and I actually had this white bandeau. Luckily I packed it um, and I think it looks really cute with this. Maybe like a plain one would be a little bit better but like whatever. Then I'm wearing my Italy shoes I got from Italy. They're just like these espadrille flat form kind of things. Um, and also this is like a romper, not a dress. So that's always a plus. So guys, I call this my sisterhood of traveling 21 button. I wore this on my birthday. Another friend wore it on her birthday. Pretty sure I gave it to Charlotte on her birthday. I'm not sure if she wore it, I forgot. But anyways, here you go, babe. You really gonna wear it? No, don't worry, I was kidding. We're about to go out to meet Will and Preston and Cam and Claire and Jack and his girlfriend and whoever else is coming. All those people. And I'm gonna probably vlog a little bit on my phone, but not promising too much because we'll see. <laughs> Hi, everyone left us. Max in the bathroom, just us now. Good morning guys, happy Sunday. Checkout is at 12 and it is currently 11.35 or something, 11.40. Ryan is still in bed. So I'm challenging him and I told him he needs to pack up in three minutes. 
At first it was two, but then we compromised to three. So let's see if you can do it. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Can he do it? I'm, I'm already done. Damn. So guys, Ryan did it. He accomplished. By how much? Yeah, I beat him by like two minutes. Look at this. Okay. We are going to go check out. And then I guess we're going home. Show one last night skyline. But... Yeah. I wanted to stay here because I'm considering living here after college. And I just wanted to see what it was like to live here and kind of wake up to like this kind of view. Oh, 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 o